Hey friends, in this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to create this spin transition in Premiere Pro. Let's get started. The first thing we going to do is create an adjustment layer. I'm going to go to my project panel, right click, new item, and then go down to adjustment layer. Click OK and then drag that on top of my cut point. I want two adjustment layers for this. So I'm going to hold Option for Mac and Alt for Windows and drag adjustment layer up one track to duplicate it. Now, go to Effects panel and search for Replicate. Drag that onto the first adjustment layer and in Effect Controls, change Replicate Count to 3. Now back onto the Effects panel. Search for Mirror and drag that onto first adjustment layer as well. Do this four times. In our Effect Controls panel, we need to set the values of each mirror so that the image in the middle has a mirror on all four sides. The values are going to be different depending on which sequence resolution you're using. In this case, I'm in HD 1920 by 1080, so I'll give you the numbers for that. So my first mirror is going to be 1920 by 719 with a reflection angle of 90. My second mirror is going to be 1920 by 360 with a reflection angle of negative 90. My third 640 by 540 with a reflection angle of 180. And lastly, 1279 by 540 with a reflection angle of zero. Now you can see, I got a trippy mirror effect. Now to add a rotation, go back to effects panel and search for transform. And I'm going to drag this one on my second adjustment layer. Now in effect controls, I'm going to find scale. Set that to 300. This will bring us back to our original shot, but punched in. Now we want to add the rotation. So set a keyframe 10 frames prior to our cut point. And then I'm going to go 10 frames ahead of our cut point and set another keyframe. This time I'm going to set rotation to 360 degrees. That'll give us one full rotation. For a smoother transition, right click on the first keyframe and click on ease out. Then on the second keyframe, click to ease in. Now open rotation to take it one step further and smooth out the keyframes. Drag these little handles in to give us a nice smooth arc. You can see a nice rotation. To add some nice motion blur to it, we're going to go down to shutter angle and uncheck use composition shutter angle. And we're going to set our shutter angle to 180. And that's it. We have a nice smooth spin transition. If you want to download project files, or any of the assets used to creating this video, you can find the link in the description below. Scan this QR code to connect with Novella Film Academy. Learn video editing, graphic design, or get professional editing services, and that's it. Let us know what you'd like to see next. Drop your suggestions in the comments below. Subscribe to Novella Film Academy for more such videos.